And Brant, tonight many families are dealing with problems that came with the cold. A lot of things just don't work when the temperatures get this low. NBC 5's Dick Johnson met people tonight who have furnaces and cars that need repair. And Dick, it's a big inconvenience on a really cold night. It sure is, and it may indeed be getting warmer, Rob, but it's hard to feel it and believe it out here. We've found problems from the city to the suburbs that run the gamut, and frankly, people are getting pretty sick of it all. Mercy, on this cold night out in Streamwood, Dick Gobrecht and his family and dogs and birds could use some. The furnace I had in there, I mean, it lasted 16 years. I've had very few problems with it. But a bad day for it to go down. Yes, a very bad day for it to go down. The temperature was 62 and dropping when ARS responded to his call for help and tomorrow installs a new furnace. Tonight, the Gobricks are going to try to hunker down here with their son and two dogs and two parakeets. They did have to send their cockatiel to their other son's house, fearing it would not make it. Reporting mm -hmm. live from Streamwood, Dick Johnson, NBC5 News. Hopefully they'll snuggle up and stay warm. Thank you, Dick. This